During this video, you will see how Creo Parametric and the Flexible Modeling Extension make quick work of typical changes to designs. This video presents the kind of changes that tool and die, contract manufacturers, and manufacturing companies are asked to perform every day. In many of the CAD tools on the market, the real-time editing or direct editing that you're about to see isn't available. The speed at which Creo Parametric and the Flexible Modeling Extension allow you to make edits to CAD geometry saves hours and dollars while helping decrease project turnaround time and increase shop productivity. Let's move on to the demonstration. Let's pretend that the customer just called to say they need you to make some changes to a file they sent over last night. This could be a complicated request depending on what sort of file was originally sent. In this video, we will be opening and making edits to a Parasolid step file. As you can see, the geometry has opened up very quickly and there is no parametric information in the model tree. Next, you'll see our engineer direct select the end of this part and pull to extend and offset the base geometry. Using the flexible modeling extension, this can be done directly, in real time, by selecting directly on a point or surface and selecting the offset tool from the new ribbon interface. It makes it very easy and quick to make common changes. If you look at the model tree to the left, you will notice that the changes to the part are captured as features or changes to geometry, but it is not adding a full parametric feature to the tree. It is simply adding geometry. Even though the additions are not parametric, you can still edit and change feature values. Next, you'll see the engineer flip over the part and edit the depth of the shell by 3 quarters of a millimeter. This change is also as easy as clicking on the surface you wish to affect and selecting the offset tool from the ribbon. The flexible modeling extension knows to not only move the surface, but also move the round geometry by the defined distance. Once again, you'll see the direct edit noted in the model tree. Now, you'll see the engineer make changes to the position and size of the boss on the top of this part, leveraging the feature recognition tools in the ribbon toolbar to very quickly select all of the features for the move, and then, after selecting the move tool, dragging, pushing, and pulling the feature into place without any anchor or reference. The tool is even able to generate the geometry, even with intersecting rounds and surfaces, as the boss is pulled over the edge of the part. After this change is accepted, the model will regenerate, and then you can see the new geometry. Now, we're going to undo the change to this boss feature and make a similar change, but this time, we'll leverage a surface as an origin or reference for the changes. This comes in handy when you need to move something a specific distance or make something a specific size. When it comes to a customer change request, this method of performing a change will most likely be the method of choice. Customers don't typically tell you to move a feature out of the way. They ask you to move a feature by a quarter inch or a tenth of an inch or maybe 20 millimeters or something to that effect. Next, we'll gather the surfaces of one of the other bosses and make real-time direct change. You'll see our engineer use all of the functionality and methods from the other edits to drag the boss around using dimensions and references, but also leveraging the direct real-time geometry editing. You will even see the boss tilted or rotated on its axis by clicking on the appropriate drag handle on the move tool, dragging to the approximate angle, and fine-tuning the edit, leveraging a manually entered dimension. With Creo Parametric and the Flexible Modeling Extension, you can make some pretty dramatic changes to a part in very little time. If the change required it, a person could even extend the boss on the fly, as you'll see in just a second. Now, in the real world, some change requests result in a conflict with another feature of a part. Let's say this happened with the second boss. 
Now with Creo Parametric and Flexible Modeling Extension, we will quickly move the boss out of the way to eliminate any interference. Simply collect all the affected surfaces, select the Move tool, and make your change. Really, that's all there is to it. If you are a tool, die, or contract manufacturer, Creo Parametric, paired with the direct modeling capabilities of Flexible Modeling Extension, can dramatically increase your productivity. It's easy to learn and easy to use, and the interface allows you to create geometry faster than ever and edit existing and legacy data faster than you ever thought possible. If you would like to learn more about these tools, please reach out to us. You can find us online at eacpds.com or you can call us at 1-888-225-7579. Either way, we hope you found this video interesting. If you would like to see more demonstrations, please give us a call.